The DreamTech T30 is one of the most feature-rich and lightest vacuums I've ever used, and I'm gonna show you why I think you might wanna could check it out. Now you can see right there, we're gonna talk about its specs. So let's talk about specs. It is a 150,000 RPM high-speed motor, which generates a suction force of 190 AW. If you are wondering, what does that mean? Like, what, what does that mean? I don't understand. I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna break it down for you. 190 AW accounts for the suction power. Your Tinico S12, which I love, 145 AW, which most of your budget-friendly cordless vacuums are gonna be in your 100 to 120 AW range. And if you get to your premium, your Miele, your Dyson V11, suddenly now we're gonna be in our 180 and up camp, 175 and 80 and up camp. The Dream Tech is pretty much in line with the Dyson V11. Pretty much. It is more powerful than your Dyson V10. Not by a lot, but it still is more powerful. So this is why, this is why it's interesting, right? It's interesting that you have this machine that has more technology. I think the attachments are equally good on both. The Dyson will have a longer warranty at two years over one year on the Dream Tech. The Dream here is gonna be one of the ultimate vacuums for you. You're gonna be getting a LED indicator. And this indicator is the most advanced of all the systems that we've tried here, uh, right? You'll notice that this is substantially lighter. You also notice that the canisters are orientated differently. The Dyson, you have to remove, you have to remove the wand in order to empty it. In order to empty it, which is this action, you have to remove the wand. We have it on continuous cleaning mode. Continuous cleaning mode means if I press this trigger, it's just gonna clean. It's just gonna stay on. It stays on. If I press this one more time, it's cancel. It just stays on when I hold it down. This is something that Tinico shares with it. You have removable batteries. So like your drill, if you have two of these, you're gonna have 180, oh, more than that, 100, yeah, no, you have 180 minutes of runtime. But here you can see the difference or the similarity. They're very similar, except the Dyson brush roll is gonna be a little bit thicker. But in terms of the technology, they both have sensors built in and they both work very well. They both work very well to pick up your floor and they add additional torque. So what I what that means is that they will add additional torque. So when you put the when it puts applies the suction power to the ground, it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna suck up pretty much everything. And I already took everything out, so it's not really an unboxing, but this is like I just put stuff in back in its box, right? So this is not really the unboxing, but this is your cradle. This is the cradle where you're gonna be, um, you're gonna be placing your, yeah. so this is the cradle, right? This is the cradle. And you can put all your attachments. Here they have a motorized brush roll, so you get your motorized brush roll uh, for your handheld. You have a clear crevice tool. Have anyone ever seen a clear crevice tool? Well, you're seeing one here from Dream. You're seeing one here from Dream. Your user manuals. Now, what is this? I'm gonna take that out because you're gonna be like, what is that? Well, it's gonna take this attachment out. You're like, what? What is this floppy attachment, right? What is this floppy attachment? Take that out and you get your dusting brush along with your, this is like kind of like an adjustable brush with your charger. So that's everything inside the box. I've never seen a cordless vacuum with this feature except for the Shark Multiflex. Just pop it and this is gonna be able to swoop. Now suddenly I can go underneath the bed, right? Like your Multiflex, I can now vacuum underneath the bed. Let me walk you through just using it in a normal day. So we have low battery, you're gonna charge it, it charges quickly. Now you're gonna notice that there is a power curve and that's the Intelligent HD screen. It's gonna show you your power levels and when you detect dirt, it's gonna increase its power and it goes orange all the way to red and which of course wants to turbo. If you use all your battery, it's gonna show low battery and you just empty the bin with one touch. The three keys, the three pillars here on the Dream, it's gonna be 90 minute runtime. So you get 90 minute runtime, 27,000 Pascal suction, which is in line with your Dyson V11. You're getting the Multiflex tool, 
right? You're getting the multi-flex, which is now suddenly in line with your Shark multi-flex dual clean. And you get advanced sensor technology with the lightweight, like your Tinico, with the removable battery, with the removable battery. Dream Tech has really impressed me with the technology. So what I can equate this to is, if you say the Dyson is the BMW Mercedes-Benz, this is the Mercedes-Benz of, of vacuums, right? They always have quality, they always do great products. You know what to expect, reliability. To me, the Dream Tech T30 is really the Tesla. This is really the Tesla, because they pack all the technology in here that you might be looking for. So it has all the best features from a lot of various vacuums. And this is why we think the Dream Tech is worth your consideration. This is why we feel. Check it out. You might be pleasantly surprised. You might be pleasantly surprised. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye.